Hey everybody, Justin Cena here. Got an awesome video for you. This has been a brand new Shopify update. You guys may have seen it. And it's all about updated Shopify discount settings. I'm going to show you what's new in there. And uh, there's some pretty cool stuff that you're going to be able to take advantage of um, pretty much immediately. I think this is a worldwide rollout. Should be in your account right now. So you can go and log into your Shopify stores and move over into your discount section right over here. And you should see this big blue message. You can now offer discounts on multiple products or collections, set minimum purchase requirements or edit discounts, blah, blah, blah. Right, the first two things are a lot more exciting. Basically, we're just getting more options in here. And uh, if you've never checked this out, this is inside your Shopify um, uh, admin backend on the left-hand side under discounts, right? And you're gonna be able to come in here and create a discount code, right? And obviously that's the most straightforward part and I'll walk you through this right now. Come over here and I'm just gonna call this test code. This is literally the code that you would give to users. Maybe you're going to promote it through an ad or through an email or through a pop-up. This would be the code that they would copy and paste and put into checkout. You see right there, it says customers will enter this discount code at checkout. Okay. Obviously this has been around forever. Come down here, options, right? These are, uh, are your typical options over here. You can either give a percentage off fixed amount, or you could just offer free shipping. For example, over here, maybe I'll just give 15% off using the code test code. Now some options that we have here. And this was in there before as well. The discount requires a minimum purchase. Let's say you don't want to give anyone a uh, discount until they spend $100. Okay, so they uh, spend $100 or more, get 15% off. And you see the little summary up here. It's basically telling you this code is going to give 15% off the entire order for minimum purchases of $100 or more active from today on. Okay, and again, this was already there. Here's the new things that are going to come up over here. Now, you can apply this to the entire order. You could apply this to selected collections, right? You know, collections are basically just categories in Shopify. You could uh, have this apply to selected products. Okay. So why is this important, right? Well, maybe you don't want to discount some of your other products, right? Maybe you're doing free plus shipping and you're not able to offer discounts on those products. Maybe you're doing drop shipping and print on demand and you just don't have the margin on drop shipping to discount, but you definitely have the margin on t-shirts, right? Then you'd be able to go ahead and let's say just under, let's say you have a collection just for t-shirts, come under here, search for your collection. Let's say it's called t-shirts, just type in t-shirts, it would pop up and then you'd be able to apply this uh, uh, coupon code only to those products in that collection. Very, very powerful, right? Before Shopify, uh, before Shopify made this update in May 2017, uh, basically, you just had a, a coupon code. It would work for any product on the site. You weren't able to kind of pick and choose by collection or by product. Okay, so that's a pretty cool advancement here. Um, definitely some cool ways to kind of now implement discounts if you weren't able to before, if you didn't have the margin to before, you can just have this be applied to a specific amount of products or collections and really have a lot more control over where you're going to give your discount. Uh, the next one here, customer eligibility, I think this one's even better. This one to me is pretty exciting. And uh, if you followed any of my stuff on email marketing, you know how important it is for you to segment your email list, right? I have multiple segments of my list and I kind of rank these based on the quality of the customer. And I have my VIP list number one, right? These are people who have bought from me. It depends on the store and the length of time I've had the store open, but a certain number of purchases, certain number of dollars spent, right? I have people that are grouped there inside of my email marketing and those guys perform better, right? Well, I think we're going to be able to have kind of the same uh, effectiveness here when we have customer eligibility coupons, okay? And these are going to be ways to really incentivize repeat purchases. And I think the stat was something like 4% of new, it's, you know, something like 4% conversion rate uh, of uh, getting a new customer to buy, but a 60% conversion rate of getting an existing customer to buy from you again. I, I may have messed up the stats, but I'm trying to tell you is your, your existing customers are so valuable to you. They're going to make you a lot of money. And now Shopify has this great ability here to give customer eligibility to discount codes. So we're going to come over here and set this up. Now, I don't have any groups of customers. This is just a little test store that I'm uh, that I use here for my webinars and stuff, but you'd be able to have groups of customers. Okay. And maybe some of you didn't even know about customer grouping. It's inside of the customer section inside of your Shopify store, right over here. Customers. Again, this is a test site, so I don't have anything in there. I'm not going to leave the page because I have this here, but um, you would have a list of customers inside your customer section. And what you could do is create customer groups, right? This is exactly how you would create segments inside of something like MailChimp, right? You have over here the ability to create customer groups based on filters. So when you go into your customer list, you can go and search based on filters. You see these example filters, um, people who have placed at least two orders and people who have placed an order in the last month. Okay. And I'll give you a different example. Maybe you want to create a customer group of people who have placed more than five orders with you over time, right? These are like your ultra VIPs, right? Ultra VIPs in there. You'd want to create a customer list, right? Let's say we have 
um, uh, uh, a good good amount of people that do that five purchase, right? We'd have a nice uh, customer group that we could then come back over here and find that customer group, right? We'd be able to go in here, search out, right? You already have some that are, uh, these are basically your automatic um, groups, right? Repeat customers is a group automatically, but you can go even further, right? You can create, uh, you know, I have one that says VIP customers. You can create, you can call it whatever you want, right? Just groups of customers that you deem to be important. Group together, right? You're going to previously group them inside this customer section. You could take a look at the little documentation here on the Shopify site in terms of how to save customer groups. And then you'd be able to set the customer group. So the only people, or the only group of people that can use this test code right now are people inside of this eligibility group, repeat customers. Okay. And that's very, very powerful. Now, how about something else, right? And this is, a, I think this is something I'm excited to use a discount code only specific to someone who bought a product. Okay. You want to incentivize people to buy a specific product. You want to get people into a funnel. This is the best way, right? Incentivize people. Let's say you have a low entry level product or even a free plus shipping product, right? And you want to really have a true customer funnel. You give a discount out to people who buy a specific product, right? So let's say you, you create a group of anyone who bought any of your free plus shipping products, and then you promote in your ad. Not only are you giving a free plus shipping product, but anyone who purchases this free plus shipping product is automatically going to be eligible to get, let's say, 15% off their next purchase, right? Because we have this setup. And even if they shared that code, it would not be able to work for anyone who's outside of that eligibility group. So this is a true, true incentive, right? A true purchase incentive here that you're able to tie into an actual product that's tracked by Shopify. I mean, something to really be excited about there, right? You can get some, you can get, you know, incredibly creative. I mean, that's just something that kind of first popped in my head when I saw this. I'm sure there's going to be some really cool uses of how to take advantage of these new Shopify discount options. And you have usage limits over here, right? Limit one per customer, limit the amount of time. This was already, uh, you know, this was in the old, uh, the old Shopify settings as well, right? You could limit this coupon to only be used twice or one per customer, track by customer email over here, as you see. You could also set start and end date. If we want to do an end date over here, right? We can go out here and have it expire whenever we want. We'll just save the discount and then this discount will be saved. I didn't uh, come over here and choose a collection, but um, since I don't have any collections, we could just come over here and save it. But again, lots of new options here, really most specifically right in these two sections applies to customer eligibility. Get creative with this, really incentivize your customers, make your customers feel like uh, they're important, right? Make them, make them feel like you truly care uh, about them on an individual basis, create some really cool coupons and take advantage of this because this is, uh, again, brand new inside of Shopify. I think this just rolled out today or, uh, or this week and uh, some pretty exciting stuff. So I hope this video helps. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to post them in my free group. You can check it out, group.justinsener.com, or just search Senior Shopify Mastermind in Facebook, and we'd be more than happy to help you. So talk to you soon, and have a great day.